If we move on to the next surah, Surah Al Ankabut, the opening verse, Allah is telling us, We will test every one of you. This verse, we heard it several times, different places in the Quran, but this is repeated here. Allah says, do the people think that it is enough for them to say we are believers and then we are not going to test them? Allah says, we have tested all those before in order to distinguish between those who are truthful and those who are liars. When I say I believe in Allah, Allah says, okay, we will test you. So now you suffer a loss. Do you still believe in Allah? You gain a prophet. Do you still believe in Allah? You lose your arm. Do you still believe in Allah? You went through a divorce. Do you still believe in Allah? So if you do, you are a happy person. You are content. And Allah says, you've passed your test. May Allah grant us the ability to pass our tests. And may he never test us with tests that are very difficult for us to pass. Some people have huge tests, but Allah knows. Allah says, you claim to be believers. Well, we need to know whether you are telling the truth or you're just lying. What's the point? You know, if you say, for example, I'm a hafiz, people will tell you, okay, come here, lead the taraweeh. Let's see. And then you cannot start Allahu Akbar and then, you know, commence with Alif, Ba, Ta. No ways. That doesn't happen. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala protect us and grant us ease and goodness. If you are saying something, you need to prove it. You cannot be a hypocrite. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala protect us from hypocrisy.